morning, you guys. This week we're gonna learn all about rainbows and colors. It's gonna be so much fun. And I'd like to start with an experiment about rainbow colors, but also that involves flowers. And we learned about this a few weeks ago. We learned about plants and flowers. We put something in the ground and bury it in the dirt to start a plant. Does anybody remember what that was called? That's right, a seed. So then, once the sunlight and the water go on the seed, something starts to grow. What grows? That's right, a plant. Good job. And then the parts of a plant can be partly a flower, but what is this long thing? What is that part of the plant we learned about? Good job, guys, a stem. And these green things that come off of the stem, what do we call those? Yes, leaves. And at the top of this beautiful flower, they have these white things. They're so pretty. It blooms. Yes, petals. Great job. I'd like to take this white flower and we're going to put it in certain colors of food coloring. We'll film them over time and you guys will see that this flower will actually change colors. Are you guys ready to get started? The first one I'd like to do, let's see if we can make a purple one. So we'll put this one in purple water. Just add some food coloring. I have gel food coloring, but if you wanted to do this and you had liquid food coloring, you could put that in a jar. Then we put that flower in. The next one, let's try to see if we can turn it green. Put in some green water. Yes, 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 yes. The next one we will do will be yellow. I'll put in some yellow food coloring. Oh, oh wow. Mix it up real good. All right, guys, and last but not least, let's put in some red food coloring. And we'll see if we can make this one red. All right, you guys, we'll film these over time so your friends can see what's going on with them. Thank you so much, and I miss you guys. Bye.